there's been a concerted effort over the last few years to dismantle the nuclear family. Nuclear family being the mom, dad, and kids all together as one unit. Now I thought that this effort was pretty dangerous, as by pretty much every metric, kids without a father perform worse in life. And there's a lot of pundits who say that we need to return to this to save society. But then I was thinking about all these shows and movies about the 1950s, or the stories we hear about what life was like back then when the nuclear family was at its peak. In all of these stories, there were always some demons waiting just under the surface. The alcoholic dad, who's emotionally closed off and keeps everything a secret, is a well-established archetype because it's true. A lot of us grew up with that, and a lot of us have become that ourselves. The typical role of a man in this time period was working and providing for the family while the wife stayed home and cooked and raised the kids. But if this is what we were told made a man, why was there so much shadow energy? Now society has opened up to be even more fluid, but we suffer from a lack of meaning all the same. If I'm not the provider, what am I, we ask, as if providing for our family is all that was required for our fulfillment. Back then we were told what makes a man, and now we don't even have that. And even though the nuclear family is better than what we're developing into today, it still didn't give us what we needed. Our ancestors used to have rites of passage and rituals that initiated men into the community. This rite of passage was the moment that they took their place as a valued member of the community. With this new rule came responsibilities. As fathers, we have responsibilities, but when we were tribes, we had responsibilities for our entire group. We had camaraderie, we had fulfilling relationships, and we had a commitment to the thriving of our tribe. And I think what we need is more of a community. When we shrunk down to the nuclear family, that sense of meaning was lost to an extent. And with the lack of even the nuclear family, it diminished further. What's the solution to this? I don't know. I'm just a faceless voice on the internet. I just wanted to point out the situation, that it wasn't all rainbows and roses when we were the nuclear family. Now, if I were to take a stab at a solution, I'd say the best thing is to take on responsibility in whatever group we find ourselves in, build deep relationships, and focus on our group as a whole, not just our immediate family. We must find our tribe, our purpose, and work away on that. Try to find common ground with our enemies, realizing we are all global citizens out here. And from there, just enjoy it. We're here to have fun, play, and experience life. But I am by no means an expert, so let's have a discussion. What would you say we can do to add a sense of meaning back to our lives?